459 degrees. Here's your news on the go this morning. Syracuse police are investigating a suspicious death. Officers found a body under the Onondaga Creek Bridge over West Onondaga Street just before 5:30 last night. Police say they're still trying to find out who he is and how he died. He appears to be white and in his late 30s or early 40s. Parole has been denied again for the Fulton man serving a 6 to 18 year sentence for a 2009 road rage <laughs> crash that killed a Camillus man. 85 year old William LeVay has a terminal illness and is applying for early release. He pleaded guilty to aggravated vehicular homicide, DWI, and criminal possession of a weapon in the crash that led to the death of Christopher Spack. For the first time ever, blue green algae has been found in Seneca Lake. The toxic bloom was discovered along the northeast shore near Kime Beach, just south of Geneva. People living on the lake or visiting should not swim if they notice a thick film on the water. Blue-green algae exposure can cause skin or throat irritation, nausea, vomiting.